Handler coming out the front. So they are set. And uh, there are Fox Avatar was just a little bit slow first time out. The Molson Corps novice stakes over one mile. Good start made by Shamran in the dark green and also Monsieur Fudge in the purple. Treasure Bay is running keenly and is prominent. The blue and white Fox Avatar recovering a little bit of ground is just in advance of Pursuit of Truth. Aldebil, the white on the outside of Makari, is the back marker. So Monsieur Fudge is leading or at least disputing with the hard-pulling Treasure Bay. Treasure Bay now just to Monsieur Fudge in second place. Fox Avatar is following, and Shamran is also just in behind the leaders. The Red Jacket Pursuit of Truth, Al Debil, Ray Dawson on the outside, and Makari and George Bass just at the back of the field. So they're not yet at halfway, and it is Monsieur Fudge and uh, David Egan on the left, on the right, Treasure Bay, and uh, Millie Wanacott. Holly Doyle in behind on the best turned out winner, Shamran, and then on on the inside of that one is Fox Avatar. Pursuit of Truth, Al Bill just going past Pursuit of Truth. Makari is at the back, so the field have gone beyond halfway, running down towards the three. Treasure Bay is still up there at the moment. Monsieur Fudge on the inside. Shamran is now shaken up in behind, just pulled to the outer. Also, Fox Avatar is getting a squeeze. Then Pursuit of Truth trying to come into it, so Monsieur Fudge has been asked to go and just does go on a stride, but here comes Shamran on the outside. Monsieur Fudge and Shamran heading to the last Last furlong, Shamran and Holly Doyle on the right. On the left is Monsieur Fudge and David Egan. They're locking horn. Shamran just going on to Monsieur Fudge. They're clear of Fox Avatar. It's Shamran in front here and has got the better of Monsieur Fudge. Shamran has won. Monsieur Fudge second, Fox Avatar third. Photo for fourth, Pursuit of Truth and Makari. Well done to Holly Doyle. That was a lovely performance aboard Shamran. Gets off the mark for the first time. I thought he knuckled down really nicely there. Yeah, he knuckled down nicely. He got a lovely toe into the race. He went an even gallop. And um, he's just improved with each run, really. And um, we chose to, you know, take our chance in a novice again today. The race cut up quite nicely. And um, he knew his job when it mattered. And I guess Monsieur Fudge gave you quite a nice target to aim at in the end. Yeah, in the end, like I say, we went a, a nice even gallop. I probably didn't want to be following the horse that was sat second, but it um, softened the, the favourite up for me a little bit. But um, no, he's hit the line hard enough, and hopefully there's more to come. And he's had two starts in your weather now. Not quite as good as his two starts on grass. Do you think turf is what he wants? Yeah, well, to begin with, we thought he'd appreciate the old weather, but actually, like, you, you can see his form is actually better on the turf. But I think he's quite versatile. Um, you might have seen today the form um, has been franked because the horse that beat him at Windsor went out and won today um, at Sandown. So he's actually been running in some all right maidens, and um, I think a few winners have come out of the Savile race, so we can't knock him. Yeah, exactly. Son of Kingman over a mile uh, seems to be the perfect distance for now. Do you think that he could get further in time? Yeah, possibly. I mean, he's very relaxed. He's got a good mind. I don't see why he wouldn't allow himself to get further, but, the, but probably at this moment in time, he doesn't need to. OK, just wanted to ask you tomorrow. You ride Al Bashir in the Beverly Bullet. Blink and you'll miss him. Back to five furlongs. I think that's going to help him. Yeah, you never know what you're going to get with Al Bashir. He either pings the lids and he's tra he travels away or he doesn't travel and he finishes well. Um, just depends what side the belly wakes up on. But it might suit him. It might not. It's kind of unknown. But um, the, like I say, the race has cut up quite nicely. And if he's on a gain day, you know, on ratings, he should be thereabouts. Good stuff. Best of luck and well done. Thank you. Thank